Aw oh, yeah, Rivers here from Tech Connect, and I've been using the NVIDIA Shield console for a while now, and I really like it. In fact, I like it so much that I decided to upgrade to the 500GB version. The Shield TV has been a really great media player and especially game system. I like it because it's so fast, it's got lots of games for cheap, great software with voice search, and because of its fast networking speed. The Shield does have one drawback that's pretty big to me, and that is that it doesn't have an optical audio output. The speakers on my LCD TV, like a lot of LCDs, are terrible, and this is why I use a soundbar. This Samsung soundbar sounds amazing, but I really love it because it has the option to normalize or even out the high and low volume sounds. For example, on TV when a commercial starts, it's much louder than the TV show itself. Or on movies when the music gets super loud compared to the speaking, you can still hear the dialogue with this soundbar. This soundbar makes everything sound really good and I highly recommend it. The problem is that I like to run optical audio to the soundbar because I don't want to wire HDMI through the wall to the soundbar and then back to the TV again. I'd also have to get an HDMI switch for all the different HDMI inputs I use. The answer is this USB to optical converter called the Advantage Micro 2 by Turtle Beach. You simply plug it into one of the two USB ports on the back of the shield and now you have an optical output. With the optical audio output you can also stream Dolby Digital or DTS surround sound as an encoded digital audio stream to your home theater system if the app and the media support it. Kodi currently supports this. There's another cool feature about the Turtle Beach audio adapter as well and that is that it can also power analog audio sources. So say you're running a computer speakers, just plug it into the same hole that the optical out would go into without the adapter, and now you can run it to computer speakers, headphones, whatever you like. This adapter also works on PC and Mac, so you can actually run speakers from your PC or Mac without even having a sound card installed. I'll add a link to where you can buy the Audio Advantage Micro 2 in the video description down below. Let me just close by saying that if you need an optical adapter, this is the one to buy. It worked flawlessly for me, and it doesn't even need additional drivers installed. They're included in Android, Windows, and Mac. If you like this video, please hit that subscribe button. That way you'll see more videos when I release them. Thanks for watching, and as always, aloha.